Or tell me when you were here. Surprise. Do you like your surprise? Yeah, I like it. I wish I had time to pack. Yeah, well, you know, we don't get what we want, you know. Oh my goodness, aren't you excited? Yeah, honey, I'm so happy. Are we here now? Why do you have a stupid blindfold on your bloody face? I want to be surprised. You already know what the place looks like. We've been here, like, before. I know what I want. I want to be surprised. I like surprises. Shiny, you're the one who booked this vacation. Why are you wanting to be surprised when you know exactly what it's going to be? I don't know, honey. I'm just excited. Can I take it off? <laughs> yeah, okay. We'll go check in. i got to talk to the kids real quick. Okay, honey. Oh, I'm going to tell you this once and only once. You better not mess this up. I had to pay the money because we were banished from this place. So don't What? Oh, I, was, I, was telling you. I didn't do anything. Don't I didn't do anything. This is our only chance of being here this year. And I worked really hard. I had to pay like 50k. Mom, whenever I ever cause trouble on vacations. Every second of my life. Anyways, um, let's go. Man, I can already feel us sucking all the fun out of this dang vacation. <laughs> Is this the front desk? Yes, this is the front desk, sir. How can I help you? I have... I, I booked a day to live here. Um, you mean you booked a room? Yeah. Could you please tell me your last name, sir? Shining Armor. Your last name's Shining Armor. Your name... Oh, it's Armor. Okay, let me just check out that for you. <laughs> so you really never been here before? No, I said I haven't. Well, let me just tell you, you were when you were like a fetus. What? Like mom birthed you here. This is the place where I was born? Yep. Why didn't anybody tell me? I think mom will not, well, like, wants to like forget about it forever, you know? She wants to forget like, about like, my Santa, birth? Santa helped you like get birth or something, I don't know. I know mom said he was my like, godfather, like he but he... delivered you or something, I don't know. What? Why yeah. doesn't anybody tell me anything about I mean, about the name here? is Candy Cane. Like, what do you expect, you know? I mean, I knew it was because I was born on Christmas, but mom didn't really tell me much more than that. Oh, well, anyways, I'm going to go see the room now. Gosh. All right, honey, I put all the uh, bags in the room. Oh, thank you, honey. I cannot believe you're actually here. Like, this is, like, my favorite thing to do for Christmas. Like, I know. Coming to the place of your childhood dreams is just it's the like best. It's, like, so much nostalgia here. Like, and now that you're here, it's so much better, babe. No, it's not. I'm sure this family vacation is just going to bring joy to everyone, honey. Of course, she bought her freaking dang husband. looks like a freaking spaz. Honey, she, of course, she bought her husband. He's a part of the family now. No, 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 It's too soon, too soon, you know what I'm saying? Honey, but I, I'm a part of the family. I'm your wife and I'm here. Did yeah, I, but did, what? I hear you what? screaming and pouting and whining. Yeah, what about it? I don't want to hear it. I, I already told you, don't screw it up and it looks like you're like in the makings of it. Complaining doesn't screw anything up. Yes, it does. You're going to get in a fight with her. I know he's weird. It's kind of uncomfortable. Dude, he's, 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 wearing, he's wearing Anna's shawl from I Frozen. know. He's a big Frozen fan. Oh, it makes it worse. I thought but he didn't he, even but know. But he bonds with Cece, so shot up. And let's go. I can already feel it. <laughs> well, this place looks beautiful. Well, thank you, sir. Would you like a complimentary tour? <gasps> oh, yeah! My it's kids free of charge. It. You can follow Helen over here, and she'll show you everything Hi. we have around here. Okay. Yeah, we can tour. No, that sounds boring. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'll be your guide today. What the heck? Is she a robot? Why does her voice sound like that? No, I think it's just her voice. That's creepy. All right, now follow along, children. <laughs> Yay! And here lies our legendary Christmas bulb. Legend has it that if you lick it on December 25th at midnight, you will die. Wow, keep that in mind. Oh, wow! And this is our Saint Nick statue. People have said that they've heard whispers from it before. Mommy's looking at me. It's just a Santa, goodness. Mommy, is that what Santa looks like? No. All right, kids, are you ready for the main attraction? Oh, uh, I guess. Say yay! Yay! Okay, good job. Now, let me show you something amazing. And here is our most favorite thing that people tweet about and Instagram about. By the way, please refrain from using selfies. Anyways, um, our main attraction, the Timmy. Holy oh my lip God. case. Oh, she's here still. I thought we would have rotted by now. What even is that? Why'd they even keep it? This is the legendary Timmy Thompson. At least that's what we think his name is. Years ago, a customer found it in our tree, and then from our video recordings of our, you know, hotel, we saw them drag the dead body and put gasoline and light it on fire. But luckily, we stopped it before then, and now they're banished. Yeah, I wonder who that could have been. And then we thought a magnificent. 
us an idea that we can preserve him and showcase him in our, well, tiny little museum in our hotel. Oh, indeed, the legendary Timmy Thompson! Can I take a picture, please? A selfie? Well, I guess just this once, but don't use flash. Yay! Alright, well, I'll leave you guys to it. Your room is right there down the hall. Bye! Dad? Oh, no! Dad, what are you doing? I can't see you with this. Dad, no! Dad! Whoa! Oh! Honey, quick, take a picture! Oh, my gosh, do you know what? I'm going to my room. You guys deal with this. Your father is your problem now. But, but mom, mom! Help me, please, somebody! What are we gonna do? I don't know about you, I'm going back to the room, I'm hungry. Yeah, me too, I wanna see it. Also, I'm a bit peckish. So yeah, you know, it's not my fault, he's an idiot. Yeah. See ya, Dad, I'll yeah. see you later. Bye, Dad. Oh, no! Hey, Daddy, don't worry, I'll find a way out! Okay, honey, thanks! I'll just be here for now, don't worry, Daddy's safe! <laughs> OMG, you guys, what took you guys so long? Also welcome. Um, well, you see, we kind of were locked inside of the plane or jet or whatever it was. I just figured that you were using the restroom. Yeah, you guys like shut the door on us or actually specifically DJ slammed the door on us behind you guys and it locked. And so then we had to pick lock it. So you couldn't unlock it from the inside? Um, no, I don't know why it didn't. Oh, I just figured. Yeah, I was literally screaming for like a good five minutes. And it was like, I was like pounding on the door saying like, DJ, let me out, DJ. Unlocked the door and like he just like was like talking to somebody and walked off. Oh, like I thought he was saying like you guys are taking too long, like you had to use the bathroom or something. Yeah, he even said, and I quote, "Those guys are taking too long. I'm gonna shut the bloody door." But I mean, I don't think he knew it was gonna lock though. Maybe. Well, isn't that great? Well, anyways, vinyl's here now. Vinyl, I didn't know you were coming. Oh yeah, um, Shining sent me a text saying like, "Oh, you should come here today. Like we're having a Christmas, like I don't know, vacation." So I, I took an Uber here. So yeah. Oh my goodness, this place has really big renovations. Like, this is looking pretty good. Oh my goodness, there's little complimentary snacks and little books to read. Oh, yes. Oh, and a Christmas tree. Oh, and this is just so cozy. Like, oh, and they made, gave us little cookies. Oh my goodness, DJ, this is amazing. Wow, DJ, this bed looks amazing. Looks like some like creepy thing. That's a bed, it looks like a cage. Yeah, there's like a blanket in here and a pillow. Oh yes. So anyway, DJ, I was thinking you could like sleep on that chair over there, you know. I'm not sleeping on the bloody chair, you're sleeping on the bloody chair. Um, no, I'm sleeping on that. You're the one that thing. booked this room the day of. Well, I'm sorry, but you didn't, so I did. So That's exactly so, my point. Yeah, you can sleep on um yeah, let me show you, you can sleep on this thing. Oh gosh dang. There we go. So you can sleep on this sled. Look, see, it's pretty sturdy. You can lay down like this. Like, see, cozy, comfy. You're you know? so cozy and comfy. Why don't you lay on it? No, because I'm too big. You're tiny. I'm sorry. I didn't realize that you were bigger than me, Mum. Yes, because you're a fetus still. Maybe because you gained some weight. DJ. Yeah. Don't test me. I told you. You're making me sleep on wood. Well, that's because you're a brat. So, anyways, I'm gonna go. Not cause trouble on this vacation, I see. See how that goes. <laughs> Daddy, oh. I'm trying to remove the squares. Oh, it's okay, honey. I'm gonna be fine. <laughs> oh my gosh, why is he in there? Jerry! Why on earth is he in there and why is that thing still here? Thank goodness, still here. I've been trying to get him out. It's now a, he's a, uh, I don't know, it's some kind of preserved body that's been kept here. No, I know what that is. You know what it is? We're the ones who found it! So you're the teenager customers that found it and tried to light it on fire and got banished? Well, yeah, I don't really want to talk about it, but yeah, so like, I don't know, how, how did he even get in there? He wanted to take a selfie. In there? With him? I guess. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I can't believe they kept it. You were there too? Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, What's you were, I mean, you, you were technically there because, you know, you were in... You guys trying to better, buddy? I didn't, DJ was. You both were accomplishing. We were dumb kids, but, you know, I'm smarter now. What? Don't worry, Daddy, oh I'll get God. you out of that. No, we need to tell someone. Let's go to the front desk and, like, tell them that he somehow got in there and we need him to get out. I know, but Mommy said if we could do bad things on vacation, then they'll be heck to pay. I know, but we can't just leave him in there with like a freaking, I don't know, body. Eh, 
I don't know. Oh, don't worry, honey. And Daddy's got it covered. Everyone stand back. I'm going to try to push it. Oh, my gosh. I'm Daddy, gonna... no. All right, give me one, two. Daddy, no. Three. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, I did it, guys. Yay. Look at him now. He's free. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm gonna get cursed. I'm gonna go to our hotel room. You know, me too. Whoa, honey, what's this? Oh my gosh, I think that's the thing we found here. <gasps> oh, I know who that is, honey, that's Timmy. This is Timmy Thompson, we went to college together. We were on the debate team. Isn't that right, Timmy? Yeah, we had so many great times together, you know, Timmy? Um, hey babe, I don't know. Yeah, so, so anyway, so, yeah, yeah, so um, Timmy, this is my wife. This is my wife, Charlie. Isn't she pretty? Um, babe, I I don't want to break this Wait, to you, Timmy? but I think that guy's Wait, Timmy, dead. Timmy, are you okay? You're, you're not blinking, Timmy. Timmy? Timmy? I think honey, I don't think he's breathing, honey. Babe, I told you, we found <gasps> that. Oh my gosh, he's dead! Babe, no, Timmy! Oh my god! Oh my god! No, Timmy! I'm so sorry! Oh no! Oh my gosh, babe, god. I'm so crying! Oh my god! Why? And we made the best peanut riddle! Babe, but you don't understand! Oh, he's a freaking mummy! They stuffed him like a bear! No, wait, babe, you know, like, how they were talking about how they, like, there's these teens that found him and then tried to burn him alive or something? What sick freaks would do that, honey? Actually, that was us, honey, but don't- what? Wait, no! Wait, oh my no. God. Calm down, babe. Let me explain. Like, you don't understand. Like, okay, so instead of us burning him, we put him in, like, this formation where we were actually going to try to resurrect him. We weren't trying to, like, burn him. Want to try it? He's, been, try de it. he's been dead for years? Yeah, babe, like, since I was, like, 10 or something. Oh, my gosh, honey. We got we to gotta get Timmy back. Yeah, like, let's do the ritual. We didn't finish it. Okay. All right, Timmy. bring his body. Let's bring it out uh, to the bar. All right, all right let's okay. go. Let's go. Bring him. Don't worry, Timmy. We're bringing you back. Go, babe. And that's how Rudolph made friends. But that's a load of crap. I remember watching that one show. It was like a Rudolph movie. I watched it around 871 times. Oh, I remember that. That's when I lost all sanity and my brain died. Is that how you got dumb? I don't even remember anymore. Yeah, so this is my cellulite mom wants me to sleep on this dang thing. Gigi, you shouldn't call your mom that. She wants me to sleep on a plank of wood. I'm gonna call <laughs> her what I want. That's funny. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's really funny. I think my mom would like ground me if I called her that. I mean, she has massive cellulite. You don't think she does, but she really does. DJ, stop saying that out loud! You don't even, dude, you don't even have to look that hard. Just look behind <laughs> her and you'll find it. Oh dang. Guys, who wants to watch Rudolph? No, never again. You watched that way too many times. We literally no, had to leave. memories. You want to live the memories. Isn't that right, Nightmare Moon? Um, well, I never was really here before, so it would be nice to spend some time. Oh, you know, I just completely forgot because I wanted to block it out of my mind. But how did Shiny get back? Like, how did you get out of that? Oh, honey, I, I did it. I, I burst it down. What? Oh, yeah, he, like, told us to, like, stand clear. And he, like, literally bolted at it and that thing just fell. So now there's no case encasing the body. Oh, uh, yeah, that's about it. So the dead body is now just open free, open season, could be haunting us now. Yeah, but I mean, I mean, it's been there for how many years? We Jerry, haven't been here in like Jerry, five years. Do you know how these things work? Is so, if you find a dead body, you try to perform a ritual on it, then you leave it be for ten years or eight years, however long it's been, it's gonna come back to haunt you. No, stop scaring me! It's Christmas time. It's not even Halloween anymore. I'm not talking about you know. I mean, creepy stuff can happen around Christmas time, you know. Stop, DJ. We want to just have a nice Christmas. All right, please. fine. But when he starts to creep around your side of the bed, don't be telling me anything. DJ, stop. Mommy, mommy, can you tell me the story about how I was born in the hotel? Oh, yes, honey, yes, I'll tell you. It wasn't exactly pleasant. Everyone was gone. Everyone was, like, I didn't even know where they were. Like, Shining was somewhere with Cheryl and DJ was with Jerry and Cheryl. I think they were, like, finding that dead Marty. I was literally having labor. And then Santa came here to deliver presents. And he's like, oh, no. He's like, push, woman, push. And then I gave birth. And then I'm like, you know what? I'm going to name a candy cane because of you. And he's like, oh, ho, ho. Oh, no. He's like, bye. And I'm like, bye. Oh, yeah, honey, I remember that. I was with Charlie. And they were shouting at us at the bar. Wait, you guys were at the bloody bar when I was giving birth? Yeah. Anyways, um, speaking of Charlie, where is she? Actually, I don't know. Great question. She's a background character. Who cares? She'll show up eventually. DJ, she's not a background character anymore. Sure about that. I mean, yeah, she got a whole episode dedicated to herself. Gosh darn it. Her marriage is ruining everything. 
All right, honey, does the star look good enough to you? Well, like, I think we had a different one. It was just like white plastic cheap thing, but that actually looks a lot better. All right, honey, I think it's time for uh, to do the Christmas ritual music. All right, it is. We're bringing you back, buddy. We're bringing you back, Timmy. Honey, hit the switch. Okay, babe. Popcorn made for back there? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We Pretty should, nice. like, have that. That'd be really good. Maybe we should watch, um, um, what's a good Christmas? Rainyasha, Bruno. No, we'll watch, um, what's that called again? Elf or something? Isn't that fun? Ooh, that's a good one. Or Author's Christmas, too. Pretty good. Did you hear something, DJ? I swear I heard a little something. Heard what? I don't know. I thought I heard the like, See, I told you the dead bodies kind of come and get off. <laughs> Anyways, like, to, like, get our mind off of this, like, what do you want for Christmas? I want a triple XZ limited edition golden encrusted guitar. I, I just don't want to die. Wow, that's a gift. Um, I, I don't know what I want. I just want some cool, cool stuff. You know, you know, you know, also a nice jacuzzi for my honey. You know, she needs something to relax her muscles. Guys, I'm boring. I'm going to go adventure around the tree and see if I can find another dead Timmy, you know. Oh, sweetie, I don't think that's really a good idea. It's fun, like, I'm gonna go now, I. See you guys. Come on, there has to be a dead body in here somewhere. Well, they really made this really more like, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna fall or die or something. Ow, oh, eh, I'm getting poked by everything. Wait, what the heck is going on down there? What the bloody heck? What is that? What the bloody heck is going on down there? Huh? OMG, hey, sweetie, sweetie hey! hey. We're bringing back my yeah, friend we're bringing Timmy. back Timmy! Oh my, what? Oh my gosh, you found him! Wait, you brought him out of the thing? I wanna join! Coming! Ow! Ow! Welcome, sweetie! What the heck? OMG, it's working! It's working! Yes, Timmy! Timmy. Come back to me! Yes! Hey, do, do you hear something? DJ, it's just Holy Night, it's a song, you know? No, it's... no, no, I'm pretty sure, like, it's gotten a lot louder from, like, outside or something. I don't know how you go look at it, I'm too tired. Well, why do I have to go look at it? They're probably, like, carolers, you know? Karen's oh, fine, like carol. fine, I'll go look at it. Go, go. Oh, I don't know about come, this. Come on, come on, Dre, let's go. Okay. Oh, oh my, my gosh! gosh! What is that? It's the body! He's alive! Wait, is he? <gasps> Timmy, you're alive! <laughs> did, did you guys just resurrect a body? Yeah, isn't it like lit? Apparently, like, that was his college buddy. Yeah. Um, did Jerry just like run away forever? I I, I really don't know. He's dealing with his own stuff right now. Uh. Mommy, what was that scream? I don't know. Oh my gosh, it sounded like a woman getting bloody murdered. <laughs> oh my gosh! There is a dead body! The Timmy got resurrected! What do you mean he got resurrected? Jerry, are you okay? You know how we tried doing it years ago? We were like doing some weird ritual thing? Yeah, well, they did it! They did it! What? Who? Who is they? Charlie and her husband! What? I didn't think they would get into that kind of weird trouble. Wait, guys, what are you talking about? And rezzing? And, and, and who was that scream? What, wait, so that scream wasn't a woman? Uh, oh no. Timmy, I never thought I'd see you again, even though I thought you were alive just an hour ago. Where am I? I was just drinking a latte with St. John the Baptist. OMG, did we interrupt? Like, you know, I'm so sorry. Timmy, I'm sorry we ripped you away from heaven, but you know, we wanted to bring you back. You just died so young, and now you could spend Christmas with us, and we can make peanut brittle together. Well, I guess I always had a dream of being a peanut brittle shop owner before I savagely got murdered inside a Christmas tree. How did you die? Did you jump? Did you fall? Well, you see, miss, I went up in the Christmas tree to go look for Santa Claus that night, but uh, I had to go a little tinkle when I was up there, so when I went pee, the stream of pee hit a light and electrocuted me, and I died. Oh my gosh, what a tragic death. Timmy, see, I told you, you just, you, you can never pee in places you don't. <laughs> you died because you're paid. You should be on, like, dumb ways to die. Ew, oh my gosh, I can't believe you've done this. Mom, can you believe it? We brought back his bestie. 
oh my, I can't believe you did this, like, literally you performed something so evil, oh my gosh, disgusting, I can't believe this. The key is we resurrected him from the dead! Why would you, what made you think that was okay? He's my college buddy. I mean, like, he's been dead for years, what is wrong with you? Oh, hi ma'am, um, I hope you're enjoying your stay, but I just wanted to let you know that you're getting kicked out. What? Why? Well, you just performed a ritual resurrection ceremony on our property, so... Oh, but, you know, it was just magic, you know, I have a horn, you have a horn. And we now we lost our main attraction. What? We lost our main attraction, ma'am. The body? He brought in $20 million every year. What? Are you kidding me? How dare you, you sick freak! Using my body for monetary gain? Actually, yes, we do own you. We bought your body from the tree. No! I'm not owned by anyone. I'm gonna be spending my Christmas with my good friend Spider-Man and make peanut brittle and get my shop like I always wanted. Good day. Oh my gosh, if this Christmas could get any weirder, I swear I'm gonna die. You know what, this is probably gonna be one of the best Christmas ever. Like, we get to spend it together, as a family. Listen, I, I, I don't really care where you spend your Christmas, but you gotta leave, because you're being kicked out. You gotta go. Hey, I call it at my house! But your house is small! Oh, you can go to mine. Mine's really big. Okay, fine, it's settled. It's at vinyls now. At least nothing can go wrong there. Hopefully not. I can't believe this happened. I already had enough embarrassment for today. Let's hurry up and let's go. You know, for once, this was actually pretty good. What with DJ? Of course it wasn't. We've been kicked out of the hotel again. Well, for once, honey, it wasn't about me. It wasn't the cause of me. I didn't do it, so I, th I think this is a win, you know?